For five years, as a cop, I was talking about police corruption. And I remember walking in that night. One cop had his revolver drawn, and the other one was standing here. What are you waiting for? Give me a hand. When I turned back, I got shot. We had a vision of what policing was about, and it was something good. But what happens when you go into these institutions and you see that it's a racket? When I became a cop, I'd stop somebody. The guy's going to bribe me. The guy's supposed to be training you. Comes back with $35. Everybody was paying bribes. Most of us just went along. They're afraid to be honest, and that's a bad system. I was to give them 50% of everything that I saw. The cop took everything except a watch. Do you report that? What are you going to report it to? Serpico. Serpico. Frank Serpico. The guy's telling me, take the money. We'd feel a lot better. And I said, what do I care what you feel? I like to sleep at night. My father said, nobody can make you do what you don't want to do. Officer Serpico, thank you for your testimony. I was going against an army. My neighbor says, don't go home. They're waiting for you. It was going to be an expose. There was this fantastic cop who was spilling the beans. He knew literally where the bodies were buried. He could do a lot more damage to this web of corruption than anyone had before. And he became very famous. I was working on the movie. Al Pacino was Frank Serpico. One day, they're doing the scene. I say, cut. I don't remember that scene. The director says, well, it happened in my life. Well, if you're making a movie about your life, put it in there. But leave it the hell out of mine. People say, I can't believe that police would do such a thing. If you don't believe it, it will happen. It's one of the great moral exemplars of our time. You got a loud mouth, Serpico. Would you just listen At to At least it's honest. People like Frank Serpico remind you that you too can speak the truth and can confront power. That's something that he did, but that's not really who he is. You know that guy? Nobody knows that guy.